What's, What's up, up guys? guys? This is Victoria's Valentine's. Hey. Welcome to our channel. Welcome. Today we will be talking about cloth diapering. Yes, cloth diapering, guys. We're coming with all the deets on how we are loving it, how baby MV Molly is loving it, yes. and uh, what else we'll be talking about. I'm just super excited. We're going to be taking you guys throughout an entire day of washing, prepping the wipes, uh, the products that we use. And uh, it's gonna be pretty exciting. Um, the pros, the cons, raw, everything. We're gonna <laughs> give it to you raw. You guys will be seeing poop on the diaper, what it smells like. We just wanna give you guys exactly how what we've been experiencing over the last what four, four weeks, weeks now. Yep. Going into four weeks. Of yep. Cloth so diaper. we knew cloth diaper was something that we were gonna do from the jump. We just didn't know when we would incorporate it. Mm -hmm. um, we tried to try it out at two weeks, and it was just too much with baby yeah. using the bathroom so frequently. He would yeah. feed every hour and eat. Yeah. Poop, feed, pee, poop, poop, pee, pee. And we was like, okay, let's stick back to a little bit longer when we said we would. So we started right after, uh, he was probably like a month and a week old. Yeah, yeah. Um, and we've been loving it. Yeah, we've been loving it. So uh, we're going to take you guys into everything and um, we're going to link everything that we share today um, in the description below um, so you guys can be along this journey with us. So some of y'all are probably like, they're crazy, number one. Some of y'all <laughs> probably are watching and probably like, what is cloth diapers? And some of you guys are probably like, yeah, I just had a baby and I'm interested in this as well. So we'll cover it for all of you guys. So the people who think we crazy, yes, we think we crazy too. Um, from the jump when we uh, decided, when we was having baby, we decided that we were going to do cloth diapers and our family thought we was crazy as well. I think they pretty, you know, cool about it now, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I think- Until they got to change one. Yeah, until they got to change one. But I think everybody <laughs> think it's crazy until you actually do it and see that it's really not that that complicated. I will say um, we had a bonus being as though we're stay at home parents Very. and we can give him all of our full attention and everything like that. Yeah. So let's get into cloth diapers. So mm -hmm. these are cloth diapers, all right? So well, those are this the ones is, we're using these are the ones right we're now. using right now, mm -hmm. but there's a lot of different brands. Yeah. So this is actually the cover of the, um, the diaper, okay? This is the actual insert itself. So there's so many different kinds of cloth diapers, like literally, like so many different brands, so many different styles. This style already comes with an insert and it's like stuck in. So it's got buttons on it. People would be like, how do you keep them on? So we'll show you guys how to put them on, but it's buttons on them and then you use the cover mm -hmm. and you cover them and they're so cute and they come in so many different styles and colors and patterns and everything. So these are cloth diapers. When you go to change, I'm sure Marcus will get into it, mm -hmm. but you just change this part unless this part um, needs attention immediately, but you should be able to keep this on for like a whole day yeah. and just uh, keep going through the different inserts. Yep. Okay, yep. Um, so we uh, plan to start around the two month mark because we knew in the beginning the poop was gonna be loose. Mm -hmm. um, uh, he would have meconium. We knew that he would be going to the bathroom more frequently, um, but we did try it at like week two because we were using disposable, mm -hmm. um, but we really, really wanted to use the cloth diapers. The disposables, they irritate your skin. Guys, Marcus actually used cloth diapers. He was allergic to disposable diapers. Yeah, no so he, so it was like perfect. So uh, he's a, a, a frequent user. <laughs> Didn't even know until his mom told us. Um, but yeah, so we uh, we wanted we wanted to give it a try. So we gave it a try early at the two week mark. It was a mess. Like he was using a bathroom every hour, peeing, pooping. Like yeah. it was just like frequent changing, 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 changing. And like the end of the night, it was up. like this is way too much. Yeah. Like so, um, we decided to try again at like a month and a week. And yeah. this is when like. He slowed down, he wasn't using the bathroom that much, um, so we didn't have to change him as frequently. And it worked so perfect. We absolutely love them. We've been doing it now for four weeks, right? Yeah, we're going into four yeah. weeks and we got a little system down pack mm -hmm. and we're gonna show you guys the system and everything. So yeah. um, a lot of questions people ask like, um, how many cloth diapers did you need? We uh, actually bought all of ours up front. Uh, we had them all on our registry yeah. before when we even 
before Molly even came um because we know that this is what we wanted to use so i would say we have about um i think we have close to 40 inserts 40 inserts yeah <laughs> now yeah. you don't need that many i think the recommended was like 24 but we just got a lot um we're not obviously washing it every day so we wa we'll, well you'll talk about yep, talk how about we wash washing. and everything mm -hmm. um but inserts i mean the the outs how many do you have how many do we have, we have i would say we might I don't have think, almost 10. yeah i don't think you would need more yeah, than yeah. more than 10 of because these. those you don't change the inserts every mm -hmm. time you change the diaper you change the i mean you don't change the outer yeah you, you don't change the, in, the inner mm -hmm. and um and those stay pretty after about two, three, four peas, it starts to get a little stench on it, so you might have to change it. But yeah. those last pretty, um, pretty good. But those actually are what keeps the blowouts from coming out of the diaper. Mm -hmm. um, and the the, it, the poop might get on there, but it doesn't necessarily like come out of its clothes. Yeah, if it if it if it happens to be a blowout, yeah. the blowout would be on this instead yeah. of on his clothes. Right, right, right. Um, so yeah, these are the cloth diapers. Yeah. <laughs> you guys will get a more uh, a, a in depth look as we show you guys exactly everything that we have. Mm -hmm. um, we're gonna show you all of the covers that we have, the styles that we have. We'll show you a more in depth look of the inserts. Some, some pros and cons. Oh, so yeah. pros is um, you save a lot of money. Yes. I think it was like, I don't even wanna say it cause I might be wrong, but it was like you, the average person spent like $2,500 a year mm -hmm. for a newborn for their diapers yeah um so you save a lot of money um not going through so many diapers you mm -hmm. um you can have a, you don't have to worry about like um chemicals and stuff being put in, in the diapers of course the disposables now mm -hmm. they make them um, they make you know healthier versions but um you can get like an all natural uh uh this is the one uh, organic have, cloth yeah, that's the have. um so you don't have to uh, yeah, organic cotton so mm -hmm. you don't have to worry about um your baby being sensitive or being irritated or anything like that mm -hmm. um what else do so you say, money? They are freaking cuter. Can yeah. we can we get into that? They are just freaking cuter overall. Yeah. Um, um what other another pros? pro is that uh I don't know. I, well, one uh, of the prevents pros, blowouts. Yeah, I'm about to yeah. say one of the biggest pros is the blowouts. Mm -hmm. um, but um I think that's yeah, that was, those are the pretty much the yeah, pros. And the cons oh less are, waste. Yeah, right? Yep. Less waste. I mean when we were doing um the full disposable oh, yeah. diapers. We were filling up a trash bag mm -hmm. every six, seven hours, and mm -hmm. we had the little diaper pail and everything like that. So, yeah, um, definitely less waste and mm -hmm. what we can manage. Mm -hmm. So, so the cons are that uh, you do have to pay the money up front. Obviously, <laughs> yeah. if you're gonna be getting them. Yeah. Um, or you you could start off with what you can afford. I and think it, you can make it work. And you we we kind of did it smart too because we were purchasing them before Mally even got here. Yeah. So like you mean purchase them every mm -hmm. so often and then when you're ready they'll be available to you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um some cons is that um if he goes to a daycare or if somebody else is babysitting them, yeah. they might not uh not only uh be familiar with cloth diapers but they might not be open to doing cloth diapers yeah. um because okay, it's just buddy. extra steps uh you know than the typical throwing the diaper out you get what i'm saying mm -hmm. um what else what um, you um you're gonna be washing more yep yeah. you're gonna be washing more so yeah, washing more to talk frequently. About that. um I'll, I'll talk about that when we get to the washing stage but um just be prepared to yeah, wash every so. two to three days mm -hmm. <laughs> And what else? What other cons is it? Um, oh, maybe when you're traveling, it might be hard. Oh, so yeah. we was like, when we leave the house, we'll you will the disposables. But I think we just got so good with these that we never yeah. even use disposables. We just got extra inserts inside of our diaper bag, mm -hmm. as well as some coverage. Just like you take extra clothes, yep. we take the extra. extra, extra diapers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that. But if you were on a road or something like that, mm -hmm. then uh, you might want to take disposables if you're not that comfortable with the off that bridge yeah. but yeah those are the cons and those it. are the pros <laughs> <laughs> all right let's get into it guys we're gonna get into it we're gonna start with washing um because it's actually a wash day for us um so we'll start with washing and as we're washing um i'll talk you through like how how it goes and how often we wash and what we use to wash and things like that so all right so first say happy two months to molly happy two months happy buddy. two months so happy molly two months to Josiah valentine you've been so good sitting here say happy two months everybody happy two months can you give him a happy smile two months. <laughs> get, boop, boop, boop. give him a smile <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Nah. 
No smile, you yawning, he tired. Mm, nap time. All right, see you guys at the wash. All right guys, so it's wash. This is what our wash bag looks like at our changing station. So once we done changing them, we just throw the diapers and the wipes and the inners and the hours all in this bag right here, okay? So I'll take it off this hook. And I'll head over to the wash machine. We at the wash machine. Um, we have our wash instructions on the wash machine, not just for us, but just in case somebody comes and wash Miley, um, they they know what to do and how to do it. Okay. Um, so it has the steps on here. So we like we told you, we wash every two to three days. Sometimes we take it to three, but never past three because the diapers can start to get mildew, and you don't want that to happen. All right. So um, I'm going to show you guys how I um, take the diapers out the bag. Um, I spray the the diapers with the poop in it with a stain removal spray and then the ones that just have pee in it i just throw them in a wash machine okay so i also have these from assembly all the products we use right now are from assembly um these help um break up the poop inside the diaper um, you don't have to spray the diaper you don't have to scrape anything off of it the wash machine takes care of everything so we use the assembly these are kind of like uh whatever we call them wash balls and then we also use assembly um, washing powder as well. Everything is safe. Everything is um, safe for baby to use. Let's get into it. All right. Dump everything out of the bag. Um, I'm going to spray it with uh, Baby Ganics stain and odor removal. Um, it doesn't necessarily smell bad, but it don't smell like flowers either. So, uh, what I'm going to do is, like I said, I'm going to spray the poopy ones. And, uh, this is what the P ones looks like. They're completely just plain blank and, uh, they're just wet. So they're just wet and they have basically a stale pea smell to it. If you want, you can use, uh, gloves. If not, just wash your hands when you're done. All right. So these, I just throw these in there. Um, I throw the wipes in there. Sometimes the wipe has stain from the poop. You just throw them in the washer. Because we use cloth wipes as well. Because we use, oh yeah, we use cloth wipes as well, which we'll show you guys. And these are what the outers look like. This outer got poop on it. Um, I won't spray this because it's, the outer is polyester and it comes off easy. So it's not cotton. All right, so when I get to a poopy diaper, this is what the poopy diaper looks like. Nice and poopy. So it has poop and pee on it, so I'll spray Grab the spray, I'll spray the sides of it. I'll spray the front, all everywhere where poop is, I'll spray it. And then once I'm done, I'll just toss it in the wash machine. So I'll finish that, the whole pile, I'll just go through them like that and whatever needs to be sprayed, needs to be sprayed, whatever doesn't, just gets thrown in there. And I also wash the bag as well because the bag just had all the poop and pee diapers in it. So just make sure you wash that. So. Um, I'll come back to you guys about washing cycle and everything once I'm done loading up the washing machine. <laughs> All right, y'all. Here's the here's the star of the show. Huh? Here's the star of the show. Here's the star of the show. Mommy and Daddy was washing your diapers. Here's the star of the show. Boop 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 boop. boop. What's the matter, Papa? Papa. Boop boop boop. Not happy. Okay. Will mommy pick you up? Okay, mommy pick you up. Now we have all of the diapers inside the wash machine. Um, now it's time to run our first cycle. We wash the cloth diapers twice, two times. The first time we wash it, it goes on warm water, and then we wash it on the shortest cycle. And this is just to really just get the diapers like kind of like wet, loosened up. And uh, we use one scoop of detergent. So we'll take one scoop of this, we'll put it inside there, and then we'll wash it um, until it's done. And then we'll come back um, for um, the second cycle. The first cycle stop. Now we're about to run it again. Uh, we're gonna switch the water to hot and we're gonna switch it to the heaviest load. And I'm going to add two scoops of this. And then we're gonna run it. Second cycle's done. Now we get the diapers out and we throw them in the dryer. As you can see, um, you can tell that this one had a, was one of the poopy ones because it's still a, a slight stain. You're never going to get the whole stain out. And we've been using these for four weeks and this is the only stain that you'll see. So it's pretty clean, um, smells fresh, um, nothing on it. So I'll load the dryer up and I'll run the dryer um, on the highest cycle so they can dry. I also throw those little blue, ball, blue balls in there too. And it helps the cloth diaper dry um, more, uh, I guess more easy. Alright guys, so we are done washing. 
Um, so we're gonna dump these out, we're gonna fold them and we're gonna put them away. So you guys seen the before, you guys seen the during, and here is the after. Outers, our inners, and some of our hybrids are all in ones. We'll give you guys a close look up in a second. So here goes the insides of them. These are washed and dried. You can't tell which ones had poop in them and which ones didn't, which is the point of it because that means they washed pretty good. Okay, so you guys heard me talk about the wash cycles. So here are the inners, and here are our, our all in ones. And as you can see, they come out pretty clean. Um, sometimes they have minor stains, but it's no no major stains that you like ill like or can't tolerate it. So, and they smell good. Yeah. All right, guys. So we're about to get to storing these diapers. So in the middle of the night, we can have easy access. So I'm gonna start with the inserts, and I'm just gonna fill this cute little bin up with the inserts. Right, it's a couple more. It's okay, buddy. All right. We have tons of more deeds, but obviously we needed to wash again, so it's not all of them. We got some cute ones, some cute patterns, and uh, different ones. All right. And then this is the other brand that we love. And we got a gang of these too. They all in the washer, but this is what we got for now. We had to wash again. See, that was the con. You gotta wash it again. <laughs> but it's all good. We love it. Okay. All right, guys. So this is what everything looks like on our cart. All right, so first we got our bag that diapers will go in as soon as we done changing. We got our inserts for the diapers that require inserts, which are these. These ones are all in one, so they don't require inserts. It comes with it. We got our cloth wipes. Um, this is our wipe warmer. We can take um, the white mix. So this is it made, but it comes like this, the wipe up um, wash and you can pre-make make it, or you can just squirt it on the cloth, okay? So that, and then we have um, the Pell deodorant that you can um, like pour the powder into the bag to help prevent smells, which is rarely ever um, a smell if you don't wait too long to wash. Um, this is the rash relief cream if he has a rash coming in. And this right here is the everyday hydrate and balm just to keep him hydrated down there. And then these are like, I don't know how to explain it. How would you? Uh, they liners. Liners. So we can fold these and line these inside the diapers. If he had like clumpy poop, then, uh, you could just throw this out like it kind of gives you like a barrier in a diaper. You just like remove this um, and easier to to get everything off the diaper. But we don't really um, need, find him that beneficial until he starts eating solids and start having like a solid um, poop. But all of this you guys can find on our Amazon storefront. The Victorious Valentine's will also link it as well. Um, what else do we got over here? Um, pretty much it for yeah, pretty much it for diaper essentials. We got Daddy and Molly, and we're gonna get this baby changed because we are about to hit these streets. You ready to hit these streets, Papa? Huh? All right, so right now he is wearing the um diaper that comes with an insert, so it's by assembly. So he has on an insert and then he has the cover, but we're gonna change him into the Rovia one, which is gonna be the all-in-one, okay? It's a little moist. Yeah. And you just see, and as you can see, here's the outer. It's literally dry. Completely dry. So it protects from that. So all we gotta do is change this. So we'll change him up real fast. Daddy changing your diaper. 
Is that daddy? Uh. Is that daddy changing your diaper? And this is to adjust it. To make it fit his nose. You all fresh and so clean, boy. Go, Papa. Oh, so it's pretty simple. It's pretty easy. Um, one thing you got to do is keep up with the wash. Mm -hmm. And um, just make sure if you are going to purchase the assembly line like everything that we show is on our amazon storefront everything even the white warmer like everything if you're going to use the assembly line make sure you get enough inserts because these will have to be changed every time the covers won't have to be changed as much we do got probably like like 10 total covers maybe more um they just all not done washing but you don't need as many covers you need a lot of inserts and now these Drovia ones, the inserts don't come out. So when you go to change, you just throw the diaper out. Well, throw it in the, um, you throw it in the laundry, okay? These ones are all in one. These ones come with inserts and the outer and everything is on our Amazon storefront. So that's it. That's our uh, cloth diaper journey. It's been going amazing so far. Um, despite pros and cons, everything. Uh, thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, if you guys have any questions that we didn't cover, please, uh, yeah, tell me to leave a comment. Leave yeah, a comment down comment. low, like, share, and uh, we'll also be linking everything again um, yeah. in our description. We are like cloth, pretty much like cloth diaper pros, like right now. So like, <laughs> whatever y'all need, All right. we Love got y'all. All right, until next time, stay, stay victorious. victorious.